I knew this question was gonna come up. Detroit style pizza or Chicago deep dish pizza? If I had to choose, and I'm sorry, Detroit, I gotta go with Chicago deep dish pizza. I'm sorry. I've been living here for a while, and I'm originally from the Motor City. And Chicago is like a second home, but I guess you can say I got caught up in the wind. Now, everybody knows Chicago. There's a whole nother world outside of Chicago, and they call that Chicagoland. But I'm gonna tell you about my Chicagoland. So go with me on this journey as we go around and we see some real folks. And real always recognize real. What's up, everybody? It's your main man, Spice Adams. We're in Chicagoland, and I'm about to put you on. <laughs> Let's go. Now, if we're talking Chicago, we've got to eat first. And if we're eating, I'm taking y'all to the original spot, my favorite deep dish pizza, Pequod's. Deep dish is such a Chicagoland thing. It is not replicated great anywhere other than in the Chicagoland area. There's nothing else like it. Hey, Spice. Nice to hey, see you, man. How are you? Pete, good. Man. good. Mind if I sit down? Yeah, go All ahead. All right. You the man. You know that. Large fan pepperoni, guys. It's a huge debate on who has the best deep dish pizza yeah, in please. Chicago. How and why is Pequod's the best? Well, one of our signature things is our caramelized crust. Yes, the, the uh, black ring around the pizza is is one of our signature parts of our product. Do you get a lot of regulars in here? Because I mean, it's hard to eat deep dish pizza every day. We have a wonderful loyal following that comes in here, whether it's you know once a week, once a month. If someone is in the Chicago land area, give me one reason why they should come to Pequod. Because it's an experience you have to taste to understand. Why is it so important to offer this pizza at a great price? We've got great neighbors and we want to keep them coming in here by rewarding them with the best product at a price that they can afford any day of the week. As a former pro player, I'm always looking for a great deal, but this is a surprisingly great price. Yep, gets back to those neighbors again. You know, without them, we wouldn't be here. Gotcha. If you don't mind, can I check out the kitchen? Absolutely, let's right, go. Can, can I take this with me? Absolutely. <laughs> This is our dough. Okay. He's already pre-oiled the pan. The next thing he's gonna do is cheese the pizza. So bam, yep. and then bam. I'm yeah, right. Yeah, maybe one more piece. One more? Bam. Excellent. All right. Woo. Sauce gives it taste. Okay, now we're gonna put the ingredients on. First thing he's gonna do is throw the garlic on. This is all fresh garlic. Next thing he's gonna do is he's gonna add pepperoni. Now watch what he's doing there. He's gonna put a very healthy, these are all fresh mushrooms. Yeah, gotta get a little more out there. Okay, we gotta, okay. yeah. There you go. We use the best cheeses. We use the best pepperonis. I think when you take the best of the best and put it together, you're going to get the best. Sliding in there. Once you cut it like that, then the pizza's ready to serve. Good. Oh, man. Woo. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, we need to get to the bottom line. I got to get that fade. Let's roll. Thing is, in Chicago, people's style is always on point, and I'ma need my fade to keep up. So I'm taking y'all to my usual spot, the bottom line. Oh. <laughs> we are in Gurney at the bottom line. Rob been cutting me now for 14 years. Well, what keeps me coming back here is cuts, man. Everybody here this is like brothers. So we always have a good time. Sometimes I come here, I don't even get a cut. Once you come to the bottom line, you're family, period. And you know, Rob makes sure you feel like you're part of the family. So it's more than just coming here getting haircuts. It's just a community for me, man. I, like, I, I really like the community out here. It's just relaxing to me. I come, I close my eyes, and just zone out and get a cut, you know? So when you come in, you don't think about bills, you don't think about anything. Cause you just want to come here just to let off some steam, talk some sports and just get away from reality. You know what, Rob, man, I've been coming here for a long time, man. You got some great prices, but when you got a jersey on the wall, I think you deserve the spice price. There's no such thing as a spice price. Everybody pays the same here. It's gotta make them feel special. <laughs> <laughs> if you're in the Chicago land area, you, you gotta check it out, man. I mean, like I said, even if you don't get a cut, just come by, shoot some pool. Rob, how long you been cutting here, man? 
this location, I've been here about nine years, going on 10. So how sacred is the barbershop, man? Like, talk, talk to me about that. And the barbershop, man, that's been a, you know, been a cornerstone in the community for years, bro. We are outlet for a lot of guys to come by, man, and to let off steam after a long day at work. And we offer great service. We got a great environment. Obviously, as you can see, we are a football-oriented shop. We have a lot of good conversation up in here. All right, Rob, I know it's important for you to be a good neighbor, but how important is it for you to have haircuts that fits any budget? It's a community barbershop, so we definitely got to fit the community. And, you know, the community encompasses a lot of people that have different, you know, jobs and income levels, so we definitely got to meet those needs of those people. So that's why I think it's important for us and our prices to be relatively affordable. Now we got one more stop out in Munderlein. I have to go see my former teammate, Jason McKee, who is the head coach of Carmel High School. Let's go. Chicago and football, it goes hand in hand. They love their football players. Chicago is so big. It reminded me a lot of Detroit, blue collar type of city. They love their blue collar workers, so I fit right in when playing football. Everybody was cheering for me. And then you have Chicago land. It's like a whole nother world. It's a, it's a whole nother city. Everybody in this world should at least get the experience that I'm getting. Hey, coach, you know where I'm supposed to be? Spice Adam, man. <laughs> man, man, what you doing here, man? Coming to a Carmel game, you're going to see a lot of my former teammates here supporting this community and also supporting Jason McKee as the head coach. If you're in the Chicago land area, what's going to draw you to a Carmel football game. What, what type of football are you getting? Uh, you're getting hard-nosed, fundamental football, man. I mean, like we want to play. I'm on ready. It's definitely exciting. I'm thrilled to be a part of this the community and the conference that we're in. That's a lot of good coaches in our conference doing the same thing I am. Y'all have to love this. Be passionate about it. You only get one time to play high school football, man. You know how it was when we played in the professional realm, and you know how the fans are here in the Chicagoland area. Do you get that same sense of feeling with high school football? They come out and support high school football. Especially our, our Corsair fans, they really come out. These lights right here, you only get that one time. You got the support of your whole community. <laughs> You're from Florida, I'm from Detroit. What is it about Chicagoland area that, that you love so much? It's the everlasting love from like the people. People support everything we do, so that's why you know, I've stayed here. I'm sure that's why you stayed here. As long as y'all believe in each other, y'all can get the job done. But it's such a blue collar town with blue collar individuals. Mm -hmm. Such a great opportunity and a blessing to be able to be a part of this community. Every player plays for me is expected to be a good neighbor in their community. That's one of the standards that we have. Let's bring it in, man. Carmel. Carmel on three. Y'all ready? Yes, sir. One, two, three. Carmel! Let's go, baby.